Happy New Year, Isaac. Thank you, Mr. Sheffield. Oh, Maxwell, look at the poster I had made to convince Margot to do our show, Marie Antoinette. Now, listen, when she gets here, I don't want any screw-ups. What are you doing? I'm sniffing for Alberto V05, Top Ramen, anything that reeks of Nanny Fine. <laughs> I told you, she's out of the house. Okay, okay. Oh, look, I had them paint on Margot's trademark mall. Isn't it amazing how one bodily imperfection can make someone famous? Oh, then you should be known worldwide. <laughs> Maxwell, have you noticed how calm the house is without Nanny Vine here? No one to get in the way or make a scene. <laughs> Miss Langton. Oh. <clears throat> Margot. Uh, you've met my associate, Cece Babcock. Oh, yes, we lunched at Spargo. I adored her. <laughs> Is she here? <laughs> That's me, Margot. Uh, now, about my co star, I was thinking about that delicious Lopez boy from Saved by the Bell. <laughs> what is he, 80? Next to him, you'll look less French. <laughs> Maxwell, darling, do something. Your gardener is gawking at me. Hmm? <laughs> um, uh, would, you, would you excuse me a minute? Uh, there's a wandering Jew on the terrace that needs transplanting. <laughs> You insane! What are you doing? Don't you push me! What my god, lady is inside! What way? Oh, hello, Miss Marley. Famous mole, where is it? What? Here it is. 